we are going to see all about AI and Microsoft Excel. If you are an Excel user and you struggle with a lot of things like how to write a complex formula, how to write VBA code, in any other thing, you can just take help of AI and AI will provide you the exact solution and you can just apply that and you can still win your Excel work. How? That we will see with few examples in this video. Here I have an Excel sheet and you can see uh, we have a name column. Here it contains some names and we need to generate email IDs. First name dot last name at the rate the domain name dot com. Let's say first name dot last name xyz dot com. And we need to generate the email ID for each of the name. So it is very difficult. Let's say if you have uh, 10,000 records, then it is really difficult to generate all the email IDs one by one. So we need to look for a feature which can just create all the email IDs in a very short time, very quickly, or maybe in one shot. So I don't know how to do that. So here I will ask AI to give me a solution for this. And when I say AI, we can use any AI tool like ChatGPT or Google Bard or Bing AI. So anything will help you. So the idea is to tell you how we can use AI and we can give our prompt with the scenario which you are facing and it will give us the solution. So in my uh, example here, I'll be using Bing AI. So let's see, this is Bing.com and I'll go to chat. I have an Excel sheet where I have a list of employee names in column A and I need to generate email ID for each employee present in column A in column B. How can I generate the same in let's say in one shot and now it is searching and let's see what it responds. There are different ways to generate email IDs from names in Excel. So it has given us a formula how we can uh, perform our task. But let's say if you are not interested in formula because formula looks complex. So I will say I don't want to use formula please give me another solution so the first one is flash fill you can use the flash fill feature in excel 2013 or later versions flash fill can automatically fill in value based on a pattern that you type and it has given us an example so you can go through this example you can you can go through this explanation it has also given a link to know more about flash fill or if you want to know more about flash fill you can further give a prompt please explain me more about flash Fill. Okay, so as you can see, it has given a proper explanation and after going through this explanation, I will implement this in my Excel sheet. So the first name dot last name at the rate, let's say the domain name is xyz, xyz.com. First name dot last name at xyz.com and press enter and the shortcut will apply the shortcut control E. And as you can see within a flash, within a second, it generates the email IDs for all the records as our desired format. So I didn't know about flash feel I didn't know how to do that but by just giving a prompt I got the solution and I could do that within a second now let's see one more feature here I have a table and you can see it contains four columns so let's see the first column and the third column now I want to highlight each item where the unit price is more than 50 rupees let's go to Bing AI and give our situation so this is the prompt I have given and based on that it has given me a solution select the cells so let's follow these steps so let's select all the cells of column A, control shift down and then it says click on home tab and then click on conditional formatting. So in the home tab, I need to go to conditional formatting and then it says click on new rule and then select use a formula to determine which cells to format. Okay. So in the home tab, we'll go to conditional formatting, click on new rule and it says use a formula to determine which cells to format. Then it says in the formula box, enter the following formula. So we'll just copy this formula. The condition is it should be greater than 50. Now we are good to go. We have given the formula equal to C2 greater than 50. Now uh, we need to click on format and in this drop down we have to select the red color and click on OK and click on OK. And as you can see all the values where the unit price is greater than 50 is marked in red. You can see this is 500, this is 100, this is 90. All the values in column C which are more than 50 for those records in column A it is marked with red color. Now let's go to a little more advanced feature in Excel, we can write VBA code in Excel. Now I want to generate 12 sheets starting from the month January till December. So what I have to do, I have to keep on clicking on this plus symbol and then I have to rename according to the month name, which will take a lot of time 
and effort. So this is the prompt I have given. Please give me a VBA code to create 12 seeds in an Excel file and name the seeds with month names starting from January till December. And as per our requirement, it has given us a code that we just need to copy and paste and we can run the code and it will perform the task. Now if you don't know how to run a VBA code, then again you can give your prompt and ask how to run a VBA code. Please let me know how to run a VBA code in Excel. Okay, so as I have written here, please let me know how to run a VBA code. So it has given all the methods how to run a VBA code. So let's just change our prompt. Please let me know how to write a VBA code in Excel. So let's go to our Excel sheet or Excel workbook. Here I'll press Alt F11. Then I need to insert a module. Click on module. I will copy this VBA code. I'll go here. I'll just paste the code. Now to run our code, we need to press F5. Okay, now let's go to our Excel workbook. And as you can see here, it has created 12 seeds starting from January, February, March till December. Now to delete all these sheets, we need another VBA code. So let's go to Bing AI and copy this prompt and we'll just modify this prompt. Here I will say, please give me a VBA code to delete 12 seeds from an Excel file with month names starting from January till December. Okay, so this is the code it has given. Let's copy this code. This is our Excel workbook where it contains 12 seeds from January till December and we'll run our new code just paste it and press f5 okay it has run now go to our excel file and you can see all the 12 seeds have been deleted ai is making our life much easier if we know how to use it hope you learned something new today and if you have any question please let me know in the comment section and for more ai related videos please subscribe to my channel and in our future videos we will cover more ai tools till then stay tuned and goodbye